I've come a long way since the days of working out of mom's basement. I've managed to work myself up to that corner office. So let's take a quick tour. I work here on my computer. I have the world's first calculator, cork board, white board, lots of cabinets to store things. Hey. I keep my job folders here for active jobs. More cabinets to store things, and of course the piece de resistance, my book collection. Now on the other side of my office, I'm on the guest side of my desk. I've got two guest chairs here for anyone who would like to sit down and have a chat with me. And then I keep some personal memorabilia on the shelves, I guess, just to remind me of all of those broken bones. Finally, a desk where I could just lean back in my chair and put my feet up. No, you've arrived when you're on a desk is big enough for those afternoon cat naps. Now that you've had the tour of the office on a Sunday afternoon, let's see it in action Monday morning. Hey Brad, that new pretty order for your office is here. Where do you want it? Uh, I don't know. How about right there? Sure, this chair looks comfortable, but when you understand that everything's a process and every process can be improved, how much value added time are you spending standing up and sitting down all day where you could be doing productive work? The time and effort required to get in and out of a chair all day is absolutely staggering. Nowhere else to hold a meeting? Sure, come on in. I've got some room for everybody. I can't take it. I can't take it anymore. I designed this office. I brought in all of these wastes into my environment. But not for long. Hey Brad, are you okay? You just don't look like yourself today. I don't know, something about you just seems a little different today. I know I'm sure feeling a lot better about myself these days. I was a tad out of character for a bit there. Hey, why don't you come on in? So in this corner of the office, you can see it's now beautiful. Why? Because there's nothing. It's amazing. No cabinets, no clutter. So as we pan around here, I've reduced all of my cabinets just to the essential stuff. You'd be amazed when you start going through your paperwork 
really? What do you need? So I took these cabinets that used to be down here beside each other. I didn't throw them away. I just stacked them on top of each other and added wheels. Everything on wheels, always movable. So all we gotta do, if I wanna relocate my filing cabinet, is just wheel it over here. I've got my new and improved desk. We're gonna talk about this desk in detail at the end of this video. And on this side of the office, where my books used to be over there, I just got them up out of the way onto two shelves. All my communication devices are now mounted on the wall for easy access. We've got a headset for when you're doing a lot of phone work. And we took the network, whatever this gadget is called. What is this thing called? Uh, I think it's a network hub. Network hub, good work. We put the network hub, mounted it on the wall. Traditionally, these are hidden away, but we wanted it up on the wall at desk height. So if we need access to this, it's easy, right here. We just drop the network cable, boom, and plug it into the computer or into anybody else who wants to come in to work in this office area. And if you watch Paul Aker's video on how to store cables with a bulldog clip, absolutely genius. Never gets tangled ever again. Boom, so it's hanging there. We mounted a power bar on the wall, so there's six or seven extra plugs for anyone else who wants to come in and interact with this office. This side of the office, which used to be my guest side of the office, has now been converted as well. We got a rack here that organized everything that used to be in cabinets and behind doors where we couldn't see it. Now, it's all out in the open and it's all visual. This printer, which you saw in earlier videos, was completely in the way and just didn't fit. Well now, easy access from anyone using this office, from anyone coming into this office to use the printer, and also, on wheels, everything is on wheels, so it's all completely flexible. We can reconfigure this space to do whatever we want, whenever we want. If I find myself needing to do a lot of printing, sometimes I do a lot of pamphlets and uh, binders, so forget walking to the printer to get a piece of paper. Why don't we reconfigure? I'll take my workstation to the printer. Now, no walking, working, printing, all within reach. I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, what happens if you need the desk over by the phone, because you're making phone calls, but at the same time, you're printing something that you need to file. Don't struggle, reconfigure. We get the printer, we wheel the printer right over beside my desk. We get the filing cabinet, we wheel that right over beside my desk. Now. Phone, printer, file, computer, all within reach. Speaking from a productivity standpoint, I'm ecstatic with how much more I can get done in a day. You wouldn't believe the benefits of being mobile and standing while you're working. I can't believe how much space we've managed to free up in here. I can hear myself echoing even as I take this video. There's lots of talk about what we're gonna do in the extra space, and in like most lean transformations, believe it or not, you have 50% more space than you think you do. It's all about getting rid of those seven deadly wastes. I hope this video has been a little bit entertaining, informative, and a whole lot motivational. I wanna try and inspire everybody to take a look at their work environment and where can you apply some lean thinking. If you need help with your lean journey, remember, the Center for Lean Learning is only a phone call away. The next slides will have the contact information and if you've got 15 more seconds, the outtakes are worth it. So the last piece of this puzzle was me talking about my desk and we've decided for the sake of saving you a little bit of time to put that in a separate video. So all you gotta do is search YouTube for Brad's Lean Desk and that'll pop right up.